that Galam Tarantula here. It's me, your boy. When I tell you, shit's been going down. It's been going down. Sorry for not posting so much. Um, I kind of abandoned this for a little bit. Not that I didn't think about it all the time. I just had a lot going on. Graduation, full-time job, d depressed, um, taking care of my puppy, and just a lot of other things. But I was always recording videos. I just never got to the point where I had the time to sit down and edit them because that takes like hours. But now that I'm graduated and I have a little bit more time on my hands, I will be uploading a lot more. So, like I've said before, if you have any ideas, just message me on Instagram. Um, I'll link my Instagram down below or just like put it in the comments. So today, um, after a couple of people asked me about it, I'm just going to do my skincare routine. I don't have problem skin, I'll be honest, but I used to. So I'm going to share my favorite products that I think work for anyone's skin type, right? And then I'm going to do, where do I look? I haven't made a video in so long. I literally forgot where I'm supposed to fucking look. So I'm going to go over the products that I love, products that I think work for anyone, and then my own personal skincare routine. So the first one, water. When I tell you I used to be so bad at drinking water, like my boyfriend said I was going to turn to dirt. I like legitimately wasn't thirsty. So drinking water, I try to drink, I have like one of those big 40 ounces. I try to drink at least two of those a day and that has definitely helped my skin so much. And I just think that's a health thing. Everyone should be drinking fucking water. Like, I don't know, I was crazy. Oh, oh number one. So especially like when it's, you know, like that time of the month, I drink a lot of water because then I tend to break out. I feel like I look like Albert Einstein right now. My hair is just like, what is this? What is this? Um, but it's really late at night and I just, I was like, I gotta do this for the people. Um, I was supposed to upload this the other day and I had like all my footage ready. My dog almost died because she had a raisin. Don't even get me started on this. But no, she's fine. No, she's completely healthy. Luckily, I caught it in time within like 15 minutes. I was at the hospital. She threw it up. All good. So anyway, back to skin. The best thing I've ever used my entire life, and this is good for anything, sore throats, swelling, inflammation, redness, pimples, depression, like literally anything. It comes in a regular one where you can twist the cap off and then take a cotton ball and kind of put it all over your face. But I like the spray bottle better. This is the um, Thayer's Witch Hazel and Rose. This is alcohol free. Make sure you guys are getting alcohol free. Um, my biggest problem with my skin is my redness under my cheeks and within a month I saw a huge like a drastic difference or if I have like a pimple I feel coming I use this I even got my boyfriend to use this like I put some on today because I took my makeup off so we're not yeah <laughs> the spray is intense I always forget that um next thing is Ultra Bland. This is from Lush. It smells so good. I don't know what it is. Oh, I just got it on my wall. This is a facial cleanser, a rich, soft cleansing cream that cares gently for all skin types. I've gotten this shit in my eyes before. Literally nothing. It is like made for babies. I love it. It's just good to like do it right before bed and get all that dirt and grossness off. It's, it's like one of those things where I just feel clean after. I just feel super clean. Next, it's the Mask of Magnanimity. Mag, magnanimity. Magnanimity. Face and body mask. I never use it on my body. Deep cleanses with tingly. Deep cleanse with tingly peppermint oil and scrubby aduki beans. It's very minty. As you can see, it's almost all gone. Buy the self-preserving one, by the way. So it just you don't have to put in the fridge. It just feels like it's extracting like all the grime in my pores. Um, this I think is maybe like 20 bucks, but it lasts a really long time. You really don't need a lot and it covers your whole face. My next product and my final Lush product, this is Mavis. Um, it smells so good. It's now like, I don't want to say like rebranded, but it looks different if you go into the Lush store. Um, it's a gourmet soap and it's like kind of like an exfoliating scrub. I don't really know how to describe it except that you need it and it just makes my skin feel like... I don't know like glass like it just makes it feel so soft and just really helps with the overall texture my next couple things are the Sephora skincare 
I am addicted to this now. It's so cheap and it's so good. This is the um, mask and it has zinc in it or something. And then this is the anti-aging cream. This is made, this anti-aging one is 95% na all natural ingredients. And this mask is 96% all natural ingredients. Um, and I feel like my skin is relatively sensitive and I haven't had any problems. I'm obsessed. Um, my problem areas are here and then my nose. And this helped so much. I, within two uses, I saw a drastic difference in just my pores alone and my nose. And this, when I go to bed, I just, it's a night cream. Yeah, it's a night cream, anti-aging cream. And it just helps. I just felt firm. And if I want to switch it up, I do have several moisturizers that I use. Sometimes I use that anti-aging uh, night cream one. Or I use, this is, um, it's called Canacel Dreamy Night Cream. This is cannabis infused. Um, I got this one at Whole Foods. I think it was like... 20 bucks it smells like ganja I every morning when I wake up if I use that one I just feel like refreshed my second to last goodie good old coconut oil like straight up this one's from the dollar store I I love coconut oil it's so hydrating and it just feels good on your skin and I love it but the final thing I just bought this I used it like twice and my nose piercings I don't know about you guys if you have any get oh my god I look like a pig <laughs> my nail just got stuck in it okay <laughs> not picking my nose just fixing my nose ring they get so dry around like where the actual piercing is so so dry I use Tatcha dewy skin cream in those two days they're not dry like they're completely smooth completely smooth it is so beautiful this packaging just looks expensive right it has this cute little thing i don't know so do this and it smells amazing ah uh, so i was like reading into this brand because you know it's kind of like the new th it's kind of like the new thing everyone's talking about it and I was like damn I don't want to like get something because it's a fad like I want to get something that works and I kept reading reviews and watching reviews and talking to other people at like Sephora and stuff and they were just like yeah like no this is like really like legit um so it's ultra hydrating and anti-aging replenishing Japanese purple rice for dry skin girls <laughs> girls we need to Guys, we gotta start anti-aging like now. I should have started when I was 18. Like, I'm 22 and look at this. I need Botox already. Yeah. But this is... <gasps> uh, she's expensive. <laughs> she's not cheap. She is not fucking cheap. But. Okay. Sorry. But she's not cheap at all. Is she, Rosie? No, she's not. But I would buy it again because to see a result that quick when I moisturize all the time is insane. So I'm like, damn, this shit must be worth it, right? So I'm gonna put on this, so I'm gonna put this Tatcha skin cream on just so you can see like how beautiful it makes my skin look. Wow, I put so much on. This is like $5 per fucking use. It just makes me feel pretty. Is it worth the money? Because I've seen results so quickly. Yes, 100, 100, 100 percent. I forgot one more thing. Makeup wipes. I used to only exclusively use the Neutrogena makeup wipes. They're not cheap. Sephora, I'm telling you, this Sephora skincare brand is killing it. This is... Um, their new makeup wipes. They come in a bunch of different uh, flavor flavors. <laughs> scents? Yes, scents. That's what I'm looking for. And what's really cool about these is that they have a smooth side and an exfoliating side. See like those little bumps? It's amazing. I only need one wipe to get my whole face off. Like, 
eyeliner, shadow, concealer, like thick, heavy foundation. I can get it all off. So I use a smooth side first, and then I use the exfoliating side after to get like the, the crumbs of my makeup off. Yeah, that was the video. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. I appreciate it. Make sure you like and subscribe. Uh, that'd be great. And I made that Jeffree Star haul video with my blue blood tutorial. And then the last footage of it is like completely ruined. I don't know what happened. I like lost the audio. So I'm working on it slowly but true. Why well, I look like a fucking gremlin. Don't lick the tatcha. Don't lick the tatcha. It's five dollars a lick. Until next time. Goodbye, Rosie.